Ladies and gentlemen, it has finally happened. After six long years, Manchester United lifts the Carabao Cup and finally wins a trophy, defeating Newcastle 2 0. Eric Ten Hag. What a manager he has been for United in the past 7-8 months as he becomes the first manager to help Manchester United lift a trophy in the past 6-7 to seven years. Man, what a game! What a game! Casemiro scoring the first goal of the match, the, UC, the five-time UCL champion. And he is showing so much determination, so much passion for winning a Carabao Cup. Even though it is a small trophy, it still holds a lot of importance. For a club that is on a trophy drought, it requires physical strength and mental strength to accomplish something that hasn't been there for six to seven years. Casemiro scoring the first goal in the first half and then Marcus Rashford scoring the second goal. But eventually, the VAR ruled it for a Sven Botman own goal. It was an own goal, so Rashford didn't get awarded for it. But 2-0 leading into the halftime and it was enough for Manchester United to go on and lift the trophy. It feels good. It feels good. The vibes are positive. The atmosphere is electric. Manchester United is back in the spotlight. They are the only team still in contention to win all the trophies. Three more trophies they can win. They won the Carabao Cup. They are still in contention to win the FA Cup. They can still maybe win the Premier League. They are in the title race if things go their way. And then the Europa League is still in their hands as they defeated Barcelona in the round of 32. And they face Real Betis in the round of 16 of Europa League. But today, it's time to celebrate. Manchester United, you know, they have struggled, they have crumpled under pressure, new managers, new thinkings. The last time they won a trophy was under jo Jose Mourinho, the specialist, the title specialist, Europa League. But then, six long years wait. You know, as a fan of a club, I'm, I'm not a diehard fan, but as if, if you are a diehard fan of a Manchester United club, you guys will be rotten to the core, right? Because United, they have a habit of winning trophies. They have a habit of lifting Premier Leagues, lifting Champions Leagues and lifting normal FA Cups and Carabao Cup. So now you see your club go on a trophy draw for six years. It's, it's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. And then finally seeing your trophy, seeing your club lift a trophy under a new manager who is doing amazing, who is passionate about the club, who wants the club to succeed. And the players are hungry for more. The players want to fight. The players want to keep going. This is the Manchester United you guys like and he, it's finally here. It's finally here. They have a perfect squad with a perfect manager and they can go on for the quadruple. Might not be this season but under, uh, under new owners with a great transfer budget with huge spending amounts, Manchester United's team can be reformed into a brilliant team. Into a brilliant team. They can be one of the powerhorses of Premier League again. Or even the world, they can go on to win Champions League too. It is not far off. It is not far off. I'm dead serious right now. Last season, Manchester United were struggling. They finished sixth in the Premier League, into the Europa League, out of Champions League in the round of 16 itself. Ronaldo left. We all thought it was over. But players have stepped up. Players in the form of Bruno Fernandes, Marcus Rashford, Worth Wagost also, Anthony, Jadon Sancho, Casemiro, the new signing, our maestro. Man, these players are really putting in a shift every day. Every day they come in, they, they want to prove to the fans and the manager that we deserve to play for this club. This is the biggest club in England and we deserve to play for it. So it means a lot. It means a lot. You can't deny it. I won't say much, but uh, Manchester United winning the Carabao Cup is, is somewhat of a right... They are on the right track. It, it, it only shows us the future is bright and more trophies will surely follow under Eric Ten Hag. The manager is brilliant. He's one of the best in the business right now. Like and subscribe for more football updates. I am keeping you guys posted. Hit that subscribe button and stay safe.